Hi guys, Marco here, back once again from MyColorScreen.com, bringing you the latest and greatest Android home screen tutorials. Today I'll be featuring Gary Arts, and he's created this awesome home screen here called Cards. And the awesome thing about it is if you tap that, it'll bring up your favorites as well as your status. And you can tap it again and it'll disappear. Wow, awesome stuff. And if you tap at the all apps out here, it'll bring up your app drawer. Another awesome thing is that each of these things you can tap and it'll bring up those various apps. I'll be bringing you from a stock launcher all the way up to this. I'll also provide links on the side here so you can skip to the tutorial that you want to watch as well as the link that you need is in the description below. Thank you very much. Let us begin. Okay, great. To shorten things up a bit, what I'll be doing is just showing you the Apex settings on the side over here. All you have to do is go into your Apex settings over here and you go Apex settings and then you change these these settings here according to what it is said here. Once that is done, all you need to do is change the wallpaper and it is provided by Gary Arts in his link. So we just go to the cards and we choose the one that is dual wallpaper. Now if you've set your home screens to two screens and multiple screen scrolling, you'll see it, it is, it'll bring it up like that. So we just click save and there we have it. Look at that, both screens. Now what we want to do is when we tap this little button here, it's going to swipe quickly to this screen over here, creating an optical illusion. Amazing creative stuff right there. First thing we'll do is hold down and go Apex settings and we want to change it to jump to our screen two. And for this one here, we'll swipe across and we'll change it to screen one. So when you tap it there, look, awesome stuff. Now we want that to be blank. So what we'll do is change it to a blank PNG which is also provided in the link. Boom, and then once we tap it, look at that, it brings it up. As you can see, I've set the screen transition speed to one, so it'll quickly change back and forth. Then we'll add in our Apex app drawer at the top. So when you tap it, it brings up the app drawer. Mad. All you need to do is make that a blank as well. Do not need to see it. Awesome. That is our icon setup. All we need to do now is set up our UCCW widgets over here and over here. Awesome stuff. Next, we're gonna be adding in our UCCW widgets. We'll go down and add widget, and we wanna add in UCCW. We wanna add in a four by two, and then we'll just simply resize it from there. Once you have copied them onto your phone, you'll just simply go open use up, and then find where you have saved them. I've already done that, so I'll just look for it here. So here's our first one. Now what we want to do is just resize it so that it covers that. Great. And then we'll hold it down and say send to back. Just so our app draw as well as that still brings it up. Now we'll do it for this side as well. For this user up here and this one over here. And there we have it. Now always remember, don't try and press down and drag it onto it as this will move everything around. We always want to resize it. Okay, great. So the last thing we need to do is to make these things open those various apps. So we'll open up our UCCW and we want to turn on our hotspots mode. Turn it on. So now, once you tap something, like our Gmail, it'll open up your mail. Easy as that. And there we have it. I hope you've enjoyed this tutorial. Please subscribe to the My Color Screen channel. And there'll be many more of these to come, even daily. Thank you very much, guys.